okay problem an axial pull of turn is suddenly applied on a steel rod 2.5 meter long and 1000 mm square in cross section cross section to stop calculate the strain energy which can be observed in the rod take e is equal to 200 gpa so first of all write down the given data so load it is given axial pull load it is p is equal to 20 kN p is equal to 20 kN so convert it is in kN to N that is 10 to the power 3 that is in N okay so length it is given 2 meter that is l is equal to 2.5 meter so this one it is also converted is in meter to mm that is 2.5 into 10 to the power 3 mm okay and cross section it is given a is equal to it is 1000 mm square 1000 mm square 1000 mm square cross section it is given 1000 mm square then calculate the strain energy that is u is equal to question mark u is equal to question mark when then e is equal to given e is equal to 200 gpa 200 gpa so convert it is in newton per mm square that is 200 is equal to 200 into 10 to the power 3 newton per mm square newton newton per mm square newton per mm square Newton per m square. That is modulus of elasticity. Okay. Then first of all, calculate the stress. Stress. Stress in bracket. Stress when when suddenly applied load. When suddenly applied load. When suddenly applied load. When suddenly applied load. And suddenly applied load stress sigma is equal to it is two p by a two p by a two p divided by a two p divided by a is equal to two into two into p it is twenty twenty kilonewton. 20 into 10 to the power 3 newton divided by cross sectional area it is 1000 mm square so a it is 1000 mm square 1000 mm square so it will be its stress in newton per mm square so 2 into 20 into 10 to the power 3 divided by divided by 1000 divided by 1000 it will be get 40 newton per mm square 40 newton per mm square This one it is stress, 40 newton per mm square. Okay. The next calculate the strain energy. Strain energy stored in the bar. Strain energy. Strain energy stored stored in the bar. Stored in the bar. That is in bracket capital M. So we know that mu is equal to mu is equal to sigma square sigma square sigma square into sigma square into v sigma square v divided by two e divided by two e divided by two e. V it is is equal to a into l. That is sigma square, sigma square, sigma square. V is equal to a into a into l divided by two e divided by two e divided by two e. Okay. Put all these value here. So sigma is equal to it is forty square, forty square. Forty square, forty square. Here it is. Cross-sectional area it is one thousand mm square, one thousand, and length it is two point five into ten to the power ten to the power three divided by divided by two e 
divided by 2 into e it is 400 into 10 to the power 3. So strain energy is equal to now. So 40 square into 1000 into 2.5 into 10 to the power 3 divided by 2 into 400 into 10 to the power 3. It is 10 into 10 to the power 3 Newton mm. Newton mm. Newton mm. So convert it is in kilo Newton mm. It divided by 10 to 3, 10 kilo Newton mm. So this is strain energy stored in the bar. Okay. Strain energy stored in the bar. Okay. So this one it is calculated strain energy when 20 kilonewton load applied in suddenly. Okay. 